Kitty Zuza. Okay, Esme, let's get to sleep. I want to wake up nice and early so we can open our Christmas presents. Me too, Olivia. How early were you thinking? I was thinking two or three in the morning. Oh. Not that early, Esme. Why not, Olivia? Santa delivers the presents in the middle of the night. So why don't we open them straight away? Oh. Think about it. Esme, remember what happened when you did this last year? You were so tired, you fell asleep in the middle of lunch. In your lunch. Ugh, fine. Let's wait until morning then. <sighs> Night, Esme. Night, Olivia. Okay, that's uh, two teddy bears, uh, one toy soldier, leaves us with three spinning tops, carry the potato gun, and uh, carry the spinning top, and then we've got oh, a jolly good Christmas, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Don't be so ridiculous. Interesting, not exactly what I asked Santa for. Then again, maybe a gobstopper the size of a soccer ball doesn't exist. A toy robot? Cool. Now come on, let's get to sleep. Fine. Model K D Y Z operational purpose destroy princesses. Ah! Ah! Battery zero percent. Entering shutdown mode. Ooh, that was close. Tell me about it. It almost knocked over the Christmas tree. I was more worried about us, Esme. <laughs> Esme, check this out. <gasps> Malice. Okay, princesses. I've made a couple of tweaks and now the robot will do whatever you want. Awesome. Thanks, Liliana. Yeah, thanks, Lil. No problem, princesses. Now see you in the morning to open our presents. Okay, robot. At your service, Olivia. Go in there and chase malice. Affirmative, chase malice. Let's go, Olivia. I don't want to be falling asleep in my lunch again. <laughs> Oh, I'm doing tremendously. Uh, tremendously. Oh, forget it. Guess what? I've got my Christmas tree. <gasps> Christmas tree. Christmas tree. Christmas tree. What? We haven't got a Christmas tree. So, how's yours coming along? Ours? Uh, uh, fantastic. Probably the best Christmas tree in the world! Hmm... Well, that's great! I can't wait to see it. Me too! I mean, I can see it! Because it's, it's here, it's real, and it's simply not made up! <laughs> yeah, real. Right... Well, we best get decorating. Good luck! You too! <laughs> Send me a photo when it's done! Will do! Bye! Bye! <sighs> Esme, you just told Olivia we have a Christmas tree. Yep. 
But we don't have a Christmas tree. No. So, why did you tell her we do have a Christmas tree? Because, Isabella, Olivia is always so smug when she puts up her oh so beautiful Christmas tree. Well, this year, we're going to be the ones with the beautiful tree. But we don't have a tree. I know we don't have a tree. Uh -huh. We're just going to have to make one. Um, it's a, uh, uh, it, 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 it's a, uh, <laughs> <gasps> it's Olivia, she sent us a photo of the tree. <laughs> now that is a tree, that is a green heap with tinsel on it. What are we going to do? If only our tree looked like one of these. <gasps> That's perfect! Esme, what are you doing? This will show Olivia. And scent. Haha, <laughs> this should be good. Huh? Hmm. by Trees R Us. Um, yes, yes it is, it is, yes. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, not that interesting. Oh, actually, it's very interesting. Because I was the very last one from Trees R Us yesterday. Well, it's just that it's, I, it, I, 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 Oh, fine. I just took a photo out of the catalogue, okay? You're always so smug. Look how amazing my tree is! Ugh. We forgot to get a Christmas tree. That's the truth. We just wanted one nicer than yours. Well, yes, it is, um... Pretty majestic. There you go again. Who do you want to phone to? Oh, no one. I'm sorry you're so jealous of my tree decor. <gasps> no! What's going on? I enlisted the help of an evil friend of ours. Hee hee hee. Happy Christmas, everyone. Aww. 
Completely mad. <sighs> this is getting far too easy. when you're flying high up in the air. I'm sure I'll feel the lush tropical heat of Hawaii when I land. Mwahahaha! <laughs> you posted yourself to Hawaii, but it definitely didn't work. I think I've arrived! Hawaii, here I come! Wait, hang on, this isn't Hawaii, this is, this is... The North Pole. Huh? Who said that? Ahem, <clears throat> down here. <gasps> Sorry, I didn't see you there. You're a little... Vertically challenged? Yes, I'm well aware. What, may I ask, are you doing here? I'm Esme, and I posted myself to Hawaii, and it didn't really work. Well, uh, our little village has often been called the Hawaii of the North Pole. <gasps> has it? No. Oh, well, can you help me get home? Yes. <gasps> really? No. Oh, I'm gonna be trapped here forever. But I do know someone who can. So, you want to borrow my sleigh, do you? Yes! Well, that's absolutely fine. Is it? No. Uh, oh, this is getting a bit tiresome. Look, I think I'll just walk. Thanks for the help, guys. You're welcome. <sighs> Am I? No. <laughs> mind if I borrow it just for a little bit. Well, they will, but I'll do it anyway. Ah! I'll bring it straight back. Ah! Right, time to continue my holiday. Just one little detour first. <laughs> Three anti-princess pranks. Just what I need. Hang on. This box is empty. Sit tight, Malice. Get ready 
ready for the holiday of a lifetime. Ah, <sighs> this is the light. The sun, the sea, and the sleigh. Where did you send Malice to in the end? Oh, I thought she could lend a hand to some friends of mine. <laughs> and so, if you leave your stocking out, Santa will come and fill it with presents! Wait, he'll fill it? Exactly! All the way to the top? Yep! So what you're saying is, if I leave out a giant stocking, I'll get more presents! Well, that wasn't really what I meant, Esme. Esme? Ha! <laughs> what have I unleashed? Ridiculous. Puh, you're just jealous. Right, let's check I have everything I need. One giant stocking? Check. One giant mince pie for Santa? Check. One giant glass of milk also for Santa? Check. And finally, one giant carrot for Rudolph? Check. Now all we've got to do is have one giant sleep. Night, Carrot! Good night, Esme. <laughs> this gives me an idea. <gasps> oh, mince pie and milk still here. <gasps> At least Carrot's gone. <clears throat> Is that it? One tiny little tin opener. <gasps> Maybe there's more presents down at the bottom. Wow, this stocking's a lot bigger than I thought. <gasps> it's some sort of magical tunnel. I wonder where it leads. Ooh, I hope it's the magical land of sweets or oh, oh, the chocolate factory or oh, the apple pie emporium. <laughs> yes, Esme, that's exactly where it leads. Come on, just a little further. Huh? It's a dead end. This can't be right. I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. <laughs> Going somewhere, Esme. Oh no, I'm trapped. I've been kidnapped by a Christmas stocking. Let's try and use a little bit of magic. Huh? My magic isn't working. Ha! That will be a special magic proof fabric. Oh, what am I going to do? I've got Christmas lunch to eat, leftover Christmas lunch to eat, and presents to eat. Wait a second. Food, of course! <gasps> My tin opener. I can eat it for sustenance. Or I can use it to escape. Yes, that's a much better idea. <gasps> I'm free! I'm free, I'm free! Ma 
Alice. Uh, it's me. Um, it, it's not what it looks like. Alice. Okay, relax, Esme. Put the tin opener down and we can deal with this. Come on now, Esme. Be reasonable. Esme, Esme. Ah, right. Time to get back home for Christmas lunch. Wait, you'll need this more than I do, Malice. 